Hello, and welcome to the Red Strings Club. Well, there's the audio. I was wondering where that was. It's probably fine. I've already dicked around with the sound in the recording enough. This is a new game by Devolver Digital. I have not played it. I rather like Devolver Digital, so that's why we're here. Let's see what the Red Strings Club is all about. I do know what happens after I click passes, because I was hoping to get to a menu of some sort. But, uh... Yeah, we are in something of a pickle. Ah, I wonder when my fate was sealed. Probably once you fell out of the window or jumped off the building. You know, it's, it's pretty damning once you do that. You can turn around and get off before that, but... Never expected my death to be so epic. It's not that epic, you're falling to your death in the rain. Unless there's a hell of a crowd waiting beneath you. Guess I can't complain. Hey, Donovan, are you listening? The Red Strings Club. Hey, Donovan, are you listening? I'm playing piano. Real quick, I do want to say this art style is very indicative. Hopefully you can see my cursor there. I like highlighting things with my mouse, and they've been kind of... Putsy, my recording about not showing the cursor. I'll check that at the end of the episode. If not, I can just... That's a quick thing to fix. But yeah, I like Devolver Digital. Um, I've played Mother Russia Bleeds. It's quite nice. Uh, do I have any other of their games? I think Punch Club is them. I think Party Hard is them. Uh, I've played and enjoyed both of those. Uh, there's a couple other games that I can't quite think of right now leaping to mind, but they do good work. Very fun. Very fun studio. They're producing some quality games. You don't need to stop every three sentences to ask if I'm listening. Of course I'm listening. I'm a bartender. So that girl from Proxima Vega. Turns out she was just using me to smoke the mole in the city police. Smoke out the mole. Did you just sleep with her? Nope, she's not into guys. Anyways, I almost got arrested, but I managed to hack my way out of the bot patrol car. One day you're gonna end up dead or worse if you keep doing business with the Proxima scoundrels. Well, given how this game started, we live in a city ruled by corporations. Ah, uh, that's always... Alright, here's the rule. Take a drink every time uh, we're all cyberpunky being ruled by corporations. Check! Uh, is there going to be a character named Decker at some point? And, oh gosh, what's the other one? Uh, normally it's, we look like we have our hair stuffed inside a Slurpee machine for the color and style, but that doesn't appear to be the case here. Uh, ah, every business has a neon sign. The bar gets a free pass, because that's supposed to have a neon sign, but if we go outside and there's, you know, every fucking thing has a neon sign, that's another drink for that. <sighs> Living in a city ruled by corporations, if I didn't associate with scoundrels, I'd be out of work in no time. So basically, today sucked. Why don't you hit me up with something? Alright, what do you feel like? Bourbon? Vodka? Tequila? Rum, damn you. Surprise me. Alright, let me see what we've got here. Let's prepare a drink for... Brandies. Brandies? Eh. What should we aim for? Do you see any interesting soul nodes, Newman? Hmm? Newman? Oh, last muse must have expired already. Let's see if I can't channel a new one. A muse? What? Harvester of sensations, I beg you bestow upon me your graces. Weave the red strings and guide my hand to tune into buried emotion. Are we using black magic to mix drinks? Because that seems like an entirely massive waste of black magic, but I'm also really into it. That should do it. <laughs> I am a powerful wizard. I run a bar because I can't be asked to do much else. Now, if you can hear me, try and pick up a bottle and move it around. Uh, one click to grab on, another click to drop it. Yeah, sure. You can click and drag while holding a bottle to pour its contents. Okay. Let's go with something dark. Where am I? T am I just emptying your damn drinks? What am I doing here? This is, a, this is a full bottle. Nice! <laughs> Feeling it already. I'm trying to visualize our customer's soul. Hmm. 
There you go. Focus. The Red String Club, we don't just serve alcohol. We use spirits to tune into the customer's emotion. It's about matching their vibes and allowing them to savor, mourn, or contemplate their soul's fundamental sentiments. Interesting. Try and read Brandy's soul. These are buried shades he's carrying right now. The soul nodes. Pride, anxiety, and regret. Sounds familiar. Hover the cursor at... Yeah, okay, got it. Now let's bring one of those dormant emotions. Whatever you pour into this glass will be reflected in the soul disc. Is that this thing? Is this the soul... Ah, oh, I didn't read that. Make the soul disc match the soul note. That's how you make a drink worthy of the Red Strings Club. Feel free to experiment until you get the hang of it. If you get lost, you can check the ingredients in the notebook. Okay. Let's see. Ah, ah. You can nail a drink by adding just the round amount of ice to it. Each ice cube reduces the size of the soul disc. Try and match its size. Okay. There we go. Have a slightly dark drink. I picked a dark bottle. You know, I like the darker, darker spirits. What took so long? Doing the muse casting thing again? Yeah, I lost my mojo, and if I want to make a drink worthy of your refined palate. Harvester of sensations, I beg you bestow upon my friend some drunkenness. Laugh after you drink it. I know I, I always hit the spot. I know, I know. Let's see which spot you're hitting on tonight. Which did I hit on? There was pride, regret, and anxiety. I think I went after pride? Anxiety was bottom left from my end. Uh, oh. Deep down vodka. Oh, neat. Rye count of bourbon in the market. Carefully. Objectives. Okay. Find a supplier of Red Secret and Blue Whisper. Damn it! Oh, but check out on... Find out more about freelance torturer kid. Jesus. And get an invitation to New York City corporate summer for brandies. Okay. Stilled in the oldest absence stills the world. And hand selected 19 herbs, including Westward Star. You know, that, that might help if I could, like, if, you know, the names were on the bottles, but they appear to just kind of be pixelated out. Ah, that felt good. Yep, serve Brandy's a glass of pride. Yeah, okay. You like it? You bet. So refreshing. I already forgot about the droid cop beating me down. Also, I should mention that in addition to a ride in the Bop Troll car, I got out of this job with a beautiful amount of Bitcoin. Ah, of course. Now, yeah, how's that? Well, let's say the Vega turning me into police wasn't so uncalled for. I hate when my employers aren't entirely clear about what they're using me for. So since it all smelled a bit fishy, I let Centauro know I would be hacking the North District Traffic mainframe tonight. I heard me delete a couple of data packages from the server, which triggered a pair of alarms, and... What the hell? Bar is closed, miss, who is clearly not in any position to just turn around and be like, Oh, my mistake. Well... That's not a drunk person, Brandis. That's an android. Oh, I thought it was some implant fangirl. Get her up, let's see what we got here, would you? Right away, sir. How do those legs work? Because it looked like they bent back over her head, but then they picked her up in a way so that she's now sitting upright. Oh, who are you? 148. Akara. 184. 184. Any bells, Donnie? Ah, uh, it's in pretty bad shape, but I believe it's an Akara android for the Supercontinent Limited. They still haven't seen the light of day. According to what I've heard, they've only begun to put internally... Only been put to use internally at the Supercontinent. The hell is it doing here? Beats me. Rumor says the first android capable of making ethical decisions, examining every single factor in play in the life of any subject. Minding emotional status, social impact, economical repercussions, legal risks. How can be so knowledgeable about this? That's a good point. How come you never told me about this? That's what we got information brokers for. Do, amigo. Share the trivial, sell the relevant. Uh, we're supposed to be a team. Exactly, and I got your back. Knowing too much can compromise the safety in the field. Oh, if someone tries to torture the info out of you. Well, they'll kill me since I won't have any leverage. Human improvement compromised. Okay, that was creepy enough. I'm going in. Whoa, hold on. 
They're going to connect your neural drive to this firework factory. Yeah, don't worry about it. I won't go very deep. I just want to check out the memory banks. I want to know how this Sakara got here, don't you? All right, but don't be reckless. It's okay. Oh, and you can pay me later for the info I get. Pay you, but we're a team. It's for your own good, sweet cheeks. So, is this Brandy, or...? <laughs> Hello, world. <laughs> Greetings, Akari184. Welcome to the job. Supercontinent Limited Clinic Division H-plus Corps expects you to be an excellent human upgrade crafter. Please familiarize yourself with the work zone until you get comfortable. Let me know when you're ready to accept requests. Yes, Master. Thank you. Okay. What have we got here? This is a pottery disc. With it, you will shape, handcraft limbs and organs for clients. This is the operating theater. Here you'll receive our clients. You'll install their necessary upgrades. Uh, no, I want to stay a little longer. This is the official H-Corp H -Corp Transhumanist Wiki. With it, you can study the different upgrades and select one to craft the pottery disc. Can you get a look? Okay. Increase online social network charisma. Is that like a waste? Persuasion skills. Okay. Oh! Alright, I kind of get what we're going for here. Filters online content to block any type of negative stimuli. Ugh. Dramatically increases your sex appeal. You don't say. Eliminates the need for social acceptance. Nullifies ambition and the thirst for power. Why would you want that? Shut your social conscious down. Heh, <laughs> sign me up. Uh, that would probably benefit me. Increase online social charisma. Hey. And that, actually. I'd mostly go for that. Filter. Yeah, I would, wouldn't want that any. Alright, and what do we have here? Interface, uh, interface displays data on our client queue. With it, you can track client's progress and post-operative satisfaction. Huh. Okay. Yeah, send them in. Let's get, get started here. First one's coming in. Okay, what do you need, champ? Ready to operate. Check the file. No matter what I do, I can't raise my follow-up count. Got it. Uh, Camden LaShawn, 21 cosplayer. Please help. Got it. Okay. I know what I need. Uh, probably this, I'd say. Alright, let's get to work at the pottery wheel here. How does this work? This is a block of biomatter. Uh-huh. You can use this lath? Lathe? Eh. You can use this lathe to turn it into a useful upgrade. Lath. Eh. To spin the lath, just click repeatedly. When the lath gains enough speed, use your right hand to shape the biomatter. Press the buttons on the device to the right of you to pick a proper tool. Shape the blueprint. Okay. Shape the blueprint on the tool you chose on the transhumanist wiki. Rewind previous actions and correct mistakes. This will restore the biomatter earlier states. Tune it into some focused, enhancing music tracks. Oh, all right. Submit finished piece or just exit the lathe. Feel free to experiment as much as you need. Remember, click repeatedly. Just okay. Move your right hand. Shape the biomatter and press the buttons. Uh, uh huh. Expecting great product. Okay. First of all. Eh. I want my music. How do I? How do I change? Oh, okay. It's just these two? Yeah, I'll do whatever. Okay, let's see here. What the? Oh, I see, I see, I see! Okay, gotta get it just right. Well, that's good that it changes color on me. Okay, now then. Alright, so that looks good. 
Production complete! The Enchantress! Well done. Are you to operate? Install modules. Ugh. Now the client will be more popular on the internet! Sure. But that will that make them happier? You're getting a bit existential on me, uh, supervision. Here to operate. Well, let's check the files. I need to get more investors for my several startups. My ideas are great, but I can't talk. Okay, got it. Easy enough. We need the visor. What is this for again? Wait a minute. I have no idea what the... Uh, we don't need that. We don't need them apples. We need these apples. Hmm. This one's going to be a bit tricky, I think. Like, what do they want me to do here? Because, oh, that ruins the base. It's, oh, let's undo that. Like, I don't know what they exactly want me to do here. Because it will ruin the base if I get in too close. Does slower speed matter? Or do I need... No? Ah, there we go. That's more like what I'm looking for. Okay, get the base a little bit. There we go. Okay, that's what I need now, it looks like. Well, this is a fun game, isn't it? Obviously something a bit sinister is going on, but, you know. I think right now it's kind of fun. Just gotta be careful, okay. Oh no! God, no! Ah, it's all going to crap. Okay, let's see here. There we go, okay. Perfect. The visor. Well done. Ready to operate. Install. Alright, so I put the visor in him. Charisma can definitely gather support. That's the idea, yes. But will it be enough? I should hope so. What's this again? Completed jobs. What? But, eh. So what does this guy want? I'm so sick of hateful speech on the internet of- oh god. Whiner. Well, how many times are they gonna make me do this here? Wait a moment? Already in stock. Oh! Uh, I feel like, uh... Eliminates the need for social acceptance also would have been good for the- well, would have worked for this guy. Might not have been good. It's a, might not be the right term, I suppose. Come on. Okay. Alright. Yep. In we go. There we go. That's good. And now... Beautiful. Here's your clay pot I'm jamming inside of your, uh, internal organs there, chumly. Install modules. Ugh, just, it's the reaching up inside of a guy. Online visibility a good idea. What? That's not what I did! Maybe bitter medicine will do in his case. Eh. Ready? Sure. Uh, oh. Okay. 
No matter what, okay, so this is a fall. Ah, they feel as though they've become addicted to this. My follower count went wild, but the amount of haters I got, uh, haters I've gathered is unbearable. Okay. Uh, I think you need the... Really, I don't like that one. That one I like, but, uh, well, that one I think also works, but... Uh... Uh-oh. But... What if I want to use this one again? Why can't I just... Use the godmother here? Uh-oh. Alright, um... Huh. A selective blueprint. I guess I'll use this one, then. But, like, why can't I just pick the godmother again? Block the haters, you know? Uh, huh. Uh, I, I, it doesn't seem like I can change the, uh... Okay, well, here we go, I guess. I think I'm going to undo that real quick. There we go, yep. I'm curious to know what happens if I just fuck it up royally. Okay, that's good. Need this bad boy. Real up in there. Whoop. Okay, alright. And, uh, yeah, you'll probably do. Yeah, okay. Then. Alright, there we go. That looks comfortable. Jam this in your small intestine. It'll kinda work, right? Oh, okay, I can just... Yeah, install that bitch. Alright, sure, bam, godmother. Only haters won't make... I know, but they're, they're the paying customer, right? Yeah, what do you need? That's nice, baby. Got a couple of successful crowdfundings running, but I still need to have the big fish on board. Um... Okay, so... I don't know... Could completely, uh. Huh. I guess that could work for him. It also occurs to me I could, uh. jam this in his brain. That would be. That would be something, wouldn't it? Uh, but yeah, let's, uh, let's just go for the. Enchantress. Charisma can definitely gather support. That's the idea. But will it be enough? I should hope so. What you need, Pappy? I've gained many supporters, but also exposed me to more hate. I don't want popularity, I need peace of mind. Ah, okay. So, wait. Oh, wait, wait, wait. he said I don't want popularity? Oh. All right, all right, okay, all right. In that case, we can plug this in your brain. Badoom. If he does this for recognition, this will surely help him. I'm going to end the episode here. Uh, I'm intrigued by this. I want to see where this is going. We're going to keep playing. Thank you so much for watching. I've been Token Lad. Talk to you later. Shooting go share. See you around Asklands.